one of the things that I love about film tangent is that it allows you to, for at least a brief amount of time, be it an hour and a half, 30 minutes, five minutes to be in control of somebody's emotions, which I think is so interesting. Yeah. You know, cause like, I don't know about you. I know Ren cries a lot, but like, I don't usually cry Minutely. that often. Baby boy. <laughs> but like when I'm watching a movie, like the first 10 minutes of up, you just start crying. And like that kind of power, the fact that something that you're watching can do that to you, I think is so curious and so interesting. And I wanted to be a part of that. Yeah. So that's where my, my love for filmmaking came through. And also I think a little bit of the psychology. So when it comes to where did this marriage come from of science and film, it seemed to me when I started doing Vsauce that I didn't just have to be a talking head with a black background, like talking to camera, throwing to like B roll or archival footage. Yeah. It could actually feel like an adventure that we were on. There could be a story to help explain and express what we're trying to talk about. Cause as you said, like one thing I really care about is making it feel like an adventure, making it feel like an experience that we're going on together. Yeah. It's something that's really key to me because it keeps it exciting for myself, but hopefully it keeps it exciting for the audience. Or even if you're not that in like, oh, I don't really care about the square cube block. Well, let's express it in a way where it feels really exciting and really big. And you're like, wow, I just wanted this cool journey. And now I know about all these different things. Right. So, yeah. Yeah. Were you interested in science as a kid? Mm hmm. I was a uh, I was a little tinkerer. I was really I, into building things as a kid. Did you Legos or connects? Legos. I didn't have connect money. Sorry. Guy. Oh, what? <laughs> connects were expensive. <laughs> were they? And my okay. friends would go be like, I built a roller coaster. And I was like, I built Jurassic built Park. A I don't know. I love yeah, connects. <laughs> well, OK, Richie Rich with your connects money. Whoa. OK. <laughs> I need to get I a motor metal. <laughs> for my connects. Mm, pass me my wine flask. Um, <laughs> is what Ren does all the time. I, I drink my connects wine flask with the pinky out. <laughs> mm, yes, my Capri Sun is delicious. Mm, <laughs> at, uh, 40 degrees mm. Fahrenheit. Anyway, yeah, I was really into it. I love building things. Like, I remember when I was 11, I built my very first computer. Really? Yeah. Like a full, young. like a desktop computer? Oh, yeah. I Dude. went to CompUSA back when they existed. Wow. Bought all the parts. It was an AMD processor. Man. It was dope. Yeah, wow. I, d I didn't build my first computer until I was like 20. Yeah, I was 27 when I Well, built I mean, if it makes you guys feel any better, I was 11 when you guys were like 20, so... It was about like the same time. Oh yes, that's right. Because I'm so you're, young. You're, you're like what, twenty years old right now, yeah, young my man. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I, I've always been curious about how things work and putting things together, and also just like I think, I don't know, physics has always been interesting to me because mm -hmm. I just think it's, I, I don't know, it's not super intuitive, but when you understand the concept of something, you're like, oh, now that makes sense. Like that, like force, I get it. I, I think I mean, that laws just, of the universe. Yeah, everything abides. Everything by it. Abides, by it. It abides by it. So I've been talking so much. Uh, like the dude. 